Hey guys, Molin here, and as you can see here, the winners for the Blizzard 3 awards have been announced. And you know, there was some prize money to win, 2000 for first, 400 for second, and so on. And let's go right away to what interests me the most favorite Diablo stream. And you see, yes, we are first place. I'm so happy that I actually managed to win this. This is a complete surprise to me because I never expected to win, for example. I mean, I have 48,000 followers on Twitch. The other streamers who participated in the vote had, like King Kong, had 90,000. So there's a lot more people who know other streamers than people who know me. But still, um, my fanbase is just the best. Like, I was able to win against people who have like twice as many subscribers or followers um, simply because my viewers are much more dedicated. Like, you guys are just the most dedicated fanbase. I'm really happy that I have you because you are really there when I need you. And you can see good things happen. And we won the poll and you know this second place guy King Konga like he made a video before he went or before both of us went to this Blizzard EU event in Paris and he said ah, I don't know any of the other guys there well King Konga my name is Voldan and maybe you'll know me now and get come to the realization that there's also other good Diablo streamers around and overall I'm really happy now as far as the price man is concerned I'm probably gonna um, spend it on a new computer. That's been something that I wanted to do for uh, quite some time now. This computer is already more than two years old, which is not really that old, but it has been under heavy use, you know, playing games for more than 10 hours a day, streaming them puts a lot of pressure, rendering all the videos, and with getting a new computer, even though um, a two-year-old computer, a new one is not going to be much better, it is going to be better, and I'm going to have the advantage of having two good computers, which means that I could, for example, stream on the new computer and while rendering a video on the other computer. So I could multitask more and get more videos out, produce more content and pretty much act or work simultaneously. Like, like let the other computer do some work in rendering and I can already start streaming because right now I always need to wait for the rendering to finish before I can start streaming. And there was also apparently a second category where I was nominated, most educational streamer. There were a lot of people here like Atosis, um, Grubby, and so on and I actually managed to get third place in this category and this comes really a surprise because I never advertised this and I never even talked about it but it just happened to being at the third place which gives me an additional $300 and um, to give back something to my awesome community I decided I'm gonna make a giveaway so I'm gonna give away three times $100 which is enter money for this stream award and $100 will go to my YouTube users, all you have to do is just make a comment in this video so I know that you're still here and actively watching my videos, whether you're from Diablo or from Hearthstone, it doesn't matter to me, just post a comment, can be anything, and I'll do the giveaway on Thursday. And the other $200 I'll give away two times 100 on the same time, probably 6 p.m. Central European time, as well on Thursday this week, on my stream, and it's gonna go to my Twitch viewers. The only requirement is you have to be a follower or subscriber. Um, either on the 31st January this year or before because I don't want people to just subscribe now, follow now um, to win this because I really want to reward my long-term viewers and those people who supported me and who really voted for me there. So if you think like you did a vote then you might as well sign yourself up for the giveaway here. And yeah, also interesting is the other awards now. The big winner was obviously with a double win, NL Crip, um, former Diablo uh, Hearthstone streamer, he won most engaged viewers and he also won the Hearthstone thing and got second and third and others, really crazy, um, the big winner, definitely him. And what we could do for example, what I like to do is the section most engaged viewers. Now this means how many minutes my stream viewers watch me on average and I really, for next year that's one of my goals to be on that list, like I want to make my stream so good that you actually enjoy it for let's say one hour every day and if you watch the stream for one hour every day then we could get have the potential here to get first place but this is something i would really like to improve on and hopefully or well, maybe we'll ramp up with this but a bit hilarious i found um those categories here like most dedicated streamer i mean swifty for example no offense like he's a great guy and great streamer but a lot of the time like he was streaming not himself, but just like six cameras and nothing going on. Like showing his house while he was sleeping and that this comes up on the list um, doesn't really feel that um, useful, but whatever, it's an award and yeah. Also same with like high stream average. Now I 
I was 100% sure the crit would win this, but actually there's one guy before him, Total Biscuit. Why is that? Well, Total Biscuit streams Stark of Tournaments, and when you stream tournaments, you get a lot of viewers. And this is actually why his average is even above Grip's, probably like 25,000 average, but... You know, for example, if Grip would have done the same, if he would have streamed tournaments for Hearthstone, he would easily get between 50 and 100k viewers every time. Because he alone gets more viewers than this entire East Gen fight net combined. But, you know, just happens. And also, what interested me was, uh, most popular English streamer now, I would have never thought that Grip actually comes on this list here, when he spends like, at least half of the year streaming Path of Exile. Now, he had a lot of viewers streaming Path of Exile, like he still was about 50k, I think, every time. But he was actually almost won this, even though he played like a non-Blizzard game, which doesn't account here for how many minutes watched uh, on Blizzard games, and he still managed to play some. That's really impressive. That's like if I would have been here, even though I was half a sem uh, one semester in Austin and almost never streamed from there. But yeah. Then um, another category is most dedicated viewer, which shows like how many subscriptions you have, which means this is the $5 fee. Um, Interesting thing here is Solo Poppin, who is obviously or apparently subscribed to many other WoW channels. And this is also interesting, most active viewer, like the viewer who is following the most Blizzard channels. Now, I think this is a lack of data as a result because why is most active viewer by number of channels followed and not by number of Blizzard content watched, which would have been a much more obvious choice. But from what I can tell you is, it's better than nothing, and it's really interesting that, for example, well, I want to congratulate both of my own followers, Zavin and KFK, um, who are both long-term viewers of my channel, like, they watch me a lot when I stream the album, I'm not sure if they're still watching, but um, I still want to congratulate you for winning some money, you see, being active on Twitch or on any community like YouTube can actually, maybe, win you something like I mean for example the first place all you had to do is six, follow 600 blizzard channels and he went home with two thousand dollars so for next year but I can tell you that the awards going to be different they won't have the same like most active viewer award by just number of channels followed next year I can guarantee you that but overall I'm, again I'm really happy that I have such an amazing fan base that made me win this now we won this together like you know I have been streaming and you guys have been watching me all the time supporting me voting me and it was really cool to be able to beat other giants in some of the votes and maybe we can do the same again next year and maybe even appear in more votes because I have great things planned for this year. So, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Good luck in the giveaway. Thanks for watching. I'll be back.